Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So there seems to be a bit of going backwards and forwards with Microsoft and Windows 11. And as many of you know, initially at the announcement of Windows 11 uh, earlier this year, Microsoft did state that you wouldn't be able to upgrade and install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. They didn't meet the system requirements of Windows 11. And then a short while later, they came back in August and said that you would be able to um, install Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. They didn't meet the system requirements of Windows 11, but that would not come through the free upgrade process from Windows 10 to 11. You would have to use the media, media creation tool or a Windows 11 ISO image file. Now, I have posted numerous videos on this previously, but just to recap quickly, this is the uh, little notification that shows up when you are installing Windows 11 on unsupported hardware. And just to summarize quickly, it basically says you won't be getting a quality experience. You could be having compatibility issues. Microsoft doesn't take any responsibility for damages to your PC. And they say if you proceed with installing Windows 11, your PC will no longer be supported and won't be entitled to receive updates. Now, entitled doesn't mean no, but this, uh, this little statement caused a lot of confusion, speculation and debate over the last while as to whether unsupported devices would receive updates when they started rolling out to the Windows 11 operating system. Now, as many of you are aware, the first patch Tuesday cumulative update KB5006674 started rolling out earlier this week, as well as the Net Framework security updates. And these are both security updates to the Windows 11 operating system. And there's been a lot of user reports coming in now that um, unsupported uh, devices running Windows 11 are receiving these patch Tuesday cumulative updates KB5006674 and the Net Framework update as well. Now, I personally think that this is a good move from the part of Microsoft as security updates are very important to the Windows operating system. And a lot of uh, Windows users are running Windows 11 on unsupported hardware uh, currently. And to not have updated these machines uh, with the latest security patches, I think would have been a mistake. And at large would have put a whole lot of other Windows users at risk to security vulnerabilities at the end of the day. And, you know, in my experience with Microsoft, um, only time will tell. But as I say, there have been there has been a bit of going backwards and forwards from Microsoft regarding Windows 11. And, you know, the security updates are, as I say, basically essential to Windows. But you get the optional updates, uh, the preview updates that roll out at the end of every month. And those carry the bug fixes, which uh, contain the stability uh, improvements to the Windows operating system, which just keep your PC running reliably and problem free and smoothly. So it's going to be interesting to see where Microsoft is going with this. Are they just going to be sticking with the security updates? Are they going to be pushing out and rolling out the optional bug fix updates to unsupported devices running Windows 11? Or, you know, at this stage, it's not clear where Microsoft is actually going with this. But it'll be interesting to see whether they, you know, just roll out security updates or actually push out both updates uh, this month to unsupported devices. So I just wanted to let you know that unsupported hardware running Windows 11 did receive the Patch Tuesday cumulative updates, which rolled out earlier this week. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.